What's going on, family? It's your boy, Russell the Fourth. Hey, everybody. It's me, Brandy. And welcome back once again to What They Never Told Us Weekly Check-In. How you doing? <laughs> A lot of excitement, big energy. Mm. You like that? Yes. How you doing? You good? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. What are you looking at? <laughs> <laughs> it's going to make it weird, so I'm good. We're not gonna reference that. We're just gonna move past. Does it, it look like look by me by my like where my legs would be? Does mm-hmm. it look like a like a half a circle or something right there? You see that? I don't see it. Okay. Well, if it's on there, I don't well, know I what it is, that. guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Welcome back once again. Hope y'all week has been amazing as always. Uh, we've been well. What's been new in our life? Is anything new happening? Yeah. No. I don't think so. We've been same old, same old. We, ha- I want you to know we have officially decided that we are ready. We are ready to begin. Kind of ready. <laughs> <laughs> season three. Season three, we're ready. Um, but that's but- only me recording. I don't mean y'all get to be in, let in yet. Yeah, not yet. We'll let you know. We, mm. we just ate dinner. I'm sorry. We'll indigestion. Mm. We'll let you know when. <laughs> so get up. I know that sounded crazy. <laughs> So Somebody was listening like what was that <laughs> uh, We'll let you know when we Officially drop the release date And when we're starting and all that good stuff But when I say we're ready We just made the decision like okay like, it's fine. Let's just go Let's just go <laughs> uh, So yeah we can't wait to start that um, As always we come with questions We want to talk to you guys and I want to know this Is texting cheating texting? Let me give you a scenario Yep. Let okay. me give you a specific scenario Okay let me walk you through this you are chilling in the living room. I get up, run to the bedroom. I leave my phone. My phone goes off. You check it. And you see it's a name, a name you don't recognize, mm-hmm. a girl's name. Mm-hmm. You go to it. You see I've been communicating with this person maybe for like the last three weeks. Okay. Talking frequently, you know, throughout the day. Not about much of anything. You It's come clear to you that I... um. I work with her in some capacity. Maybe not at work. I don't know. But I'm talking to her. Okay. There's nothing in there of a romantic nature, but it's clear that we're talking a lot. And go. I'm so mixed on this, right? Because we talked about this on our cheating episode last season. And I don't believe that, like, I don't, one, I don't believe that you said it would be okay for me to have new male friends that you didn't know about. So same standards apply. If I can't have new male friends, you can't have new female friends. Now, in general, I'm okay with that. But since you set a standard for me, that same standard shall apply to you. So. Oh, so this is only based on what? No, well, take this away. Take me away. You're just in a relationship. Is this a problem for you? No. In general, no. If there's nothing there that I should be sus- suspicious about, then I'm not going to just inherently be suspicious. Now, if we have past history of you being inappropriate, if we have trust issues, then okay, maybe. But if it's just a normal, healthy relationship and my man happens to be texting another female and there's nothing inappropriate in there, I'm not upset. Is there a limit to how healthy you can be with somebody? Like, what if we're texting healthily, but it's, like, all day? Like, you saw I started texting at 9 o'clock in the morning when I woke up, and we have had steady conversation all the way up until bed. That's okay? Um, I think then it's, like, what are you texting about? And why? if I don't know this person, like, if you're having that much conversation with them, why don't I know them? Then, yeah, I might get suspicious, and I might just ask you, but, like, if you give me a, you know, no, nah, she just cool, and we be kicking it. That's enough of you? Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Unless, until you give me a reason not to trust you, I'm not just gonna make something up in my head. Because I have done that in the past. I've been that girl that sees something, and because of what I see in my head, even in, even though it's not an accurate depiction of what's actually going on, I create this scenario and then create an issue where there's not an issue. Okay. And that, for me, like, he usually knows I'm not doing nothing wrong, so he not stressed, but I'm stressed. I'm like, oh, my God, what they texting about? What they talking about? What it, is he going over there? I'm following you. I'm making sure your location on, on your phone. Mm. Like, yeah, I, mm, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I don't, don't want to be that. 
Like, I'm not about to stress person. myself out. If you decide to do something inappropriate, you have to know the consequences and repercussions of that. You're going to lose me. And if talking to your person, your friend, or whoever it is, is worth that, then cool. Keep doing it. And be in, and if it, I'm saying if it goes to an inappropriate level, but if it's not, like, I'm not, I'm not creating no issue where it ain't no issue. Mm. Mm. Why you been doing that? No. Okay, because mm. I kill you. So you want to know what I think? <laughs> Are you done threatening me? Yeah, or? Sure, go ahead. <laughs> Yo, you wild. Because I kill you. You know, it's wild how often you threaten to kill me. It's got to be unhealthy. Do you feel threatened? Oh, when yeah. No, nah, I mean, I, nah, I know you mean it. And that's okay. why I feel really threatened. Then I won't say it no more because now you know. I was just trying to impress upon you that I really will kill you. But now that you believe it, like... Okay. Why girls to say stuff that dudes can't say? Because if I say that, then I might turn it. No, f- let's be clear. You've, Let me tell you. you've definitely told me that you kill, you'll kill me before. I said, you've no, no, I've never said that. Oh, that is a bold face lie. I know my statement. And my statement is, I'll fight you. That's what I say. That's a lie, you are. Okay. I, I never said I was going to kill you. That's a lie. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, nah. I see you text anybody. You cheating. <laughs> No, that's nah, not but, true. Cause you know that good. I have friends that I text, and you never said anything about it. Like who? Eric. You still be texting Eric? I ain't known about it since we've been. Time. Yeah, that is not true. Since we've been married. Yes. Would you text Eric about since we've been married? I don't know. We have to go back in the messages. Yeah, we definitely got to go back. Oh, <laughs> no, you were trying to act like that. <laughs> now nah, I'm playing. Yeah, nah. I um. I don't know. At one point in my life, I was really, I was a lot more territorial. And I don't think I'm that way anymore. But I feel like I'm supposed to be. So I want to be jealous, but I guess I'm not. I don't know. Maybe oh, I've healed. you healed. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> From what? Hey, look, I'm being so dramatic. No, but see, my thing is, I, I told you this before, like early on when we started dating, is like, if I wouldn't do it, like, I don't expect you to do it. So for me, I told you, I'm never going to put you in a situation where you even have to question that. So for me, like texting somebody that you don't know that I'm texting just feels wrong. So I'm not going to do that. But we just established that I did not know you were texting Eric still. That's a lie. Because the last time I texted Eric was when... Anyways, we'll talk about that. We're about just, to go into like, a whole nother thing. And I'm just and it hey, is, this is not even about. And, I, and for the viewers, I'm just playing. Like I'm, I'm being extra. <laughs> but yeah, like so, I never. I told you, I never want you to have to question my loyalty, or I never want you to have to be like, mm, is it a chance? She like no, because I'm not gonna do it. Like mm. it's so many things that if somebody saw you doing something, it could be misinterpreted. Like I'm not gonna put myself in that situation because soon as that thought is planted in your head, like you have to fight that every day. I would never want you to do that. That's real. Is there any part of my behavior right now that make you be like, mm, I don't know about that? You turn your location off on your phone. What? Huh? What are you talking about? Your location is not on on your phone no more. <laughs> First, hold on. Number one. It is. No, it's not. If it, hold on, wait, wait, pause. And I'm glad I'm going to pause. Let's get my phone. Huh? Let's get my phone because you're not sharing your location with me anymore. Okay. We're going to get the phone. I, first of all, it, it'll, sh- I don't, it get yours. Let's get them both because it'll show both the same. I'm glad we're doing this. It ain't going to show too. mine because I turned mine off when you said, when I found out you turned yours off. <laughs> <laughs> it's toxic. Number one, hold on, pause. Pause. Yes. Why were you checking my location? I be wondering because you don't text me to let me know that you're okay. When did this happen? When huh? did you realize this? What was going on when you were worried about my look? When um I think was when you went. <laughs> it's not like I'm lying, but I'm not. Yeah, yeah. I had to think of this. I had to think of what happened when you picked your dad up from the airport and you did or dropped him off and you didn't go home and you said, "Babe, my uh, my, I took my the location wrong turn. was off then." Yeah, I tried to find you before I called you to be like, what's up? Because we remember it was you had probably been at work 30 minutes and I'm like, okay, he still ain't called me. Let me call him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we doing a fact check. If y'all is on the audio, y'all need to understand that he is not sharing his location with me. Yes, I am. Look at this. Look at this. No, you not. Yes, I am. Don't try to toggle it back on now. He just just turned it back on. Hold on. Wait, pause though. Pause though. Pause. (laughs) Pause. No, hold on, pause. I definitely did just do that. 
But I never I now number one, this is how I know I didn't. Cause I forgot I even did it in the first place. I didn't mm-hmm. know you knew where I was at. When? Period. I don't know when no, I shared my location we with you. We did it in Nashville when we were all when the girls had went separate from the boys and we was like, okay, everybody needs to share their location in case. I remember that now. Yes. After that moment, I forgot my location was on. I've never went to see. You pause. turned to see. Hold on, pause. Now, if I was crazy, I could have been thinking already, like he turned it well, off on, intentionally. No. Hold on. I already think you're a little crazy because now I'm thinking, how, we've been here before. How often does she check up my location? Because I want to know because mm-hmm. I don't I don't believe you. About what? I don't believe that that's when my location was off. When uh, Did you know when you turned it off? I didn't turn my location. Why? Hold on. Let me think about this. Hold on. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Why? Where do I go? <laughs> what do I do? I don't know. Because I'm no, no. your location. Like yes, that. You do. yes, you do. Yes, you do. Now it's been established. I swear that I do not check your location Queen, like that. Queen, baby. I promise you. Love of my life, my yes, everything. Babe. Yes. We're here now. Listen. <laughs> Listen. Now that we've don't established that. that you know where I'm at at all times, you know where I be. I be at work or here. I'm or not keep. worried about you going anywhere. You're I'm about worried about something safety. happening to you because no, listen, <laughs> scared, I'm telling you. listen. You don't. When like, did you discover it? It be like and don't say the late airport. nights or something. It is when I discovered it. I can't. See you telling me not to say something? That's the truth. <laughs> I don't even know you. <laughs> Whatever. I hate what? that you're trying to pay yeah, me is, like that. Uh, I ain't paying you with nothing. You exactly. You know when you turned it yeah, off. Yo, when I asked you that question, I didn't know what you was about to say. But this is <laughs> what question. When I asked you, like, is there anything I do that when you say a location? <laughs> First of all, who turned my location off? Number three, when did I share my location with you? you t- Number four, how often do you check my location? You turned your location off. I did not turn my location off because I didn't even. I didn't you, even know it was on. Then why are you so adamant that I? You you absolutely know when I know when I noticed that it wasn't on. I'm not adamant. I just I have. I no noticed idea. it wasn't on because okay. So this is the scenario, y'all. Let me paint the picture. He goes oh, early in the morning <laughs> to take his dad to the airport. This wild. He gets he he drops his dad off at the airport and goes straight to work. On the way to work, he calls me and says, "I took a wrong turn. I don't know where I am. I'm just relying on GPS. I'm in the sticks." Yeah. I said, okay, call me and let me know when Share your you location it. with me. I will. Call me and let me know when you made it to work. You said you were 45 minutes away. It was an hour and a half later, and you still had not called me. So I'm like, okay, I'm not going to call him. I'm not going to bug you. I know his location is on, so I'm just going to check his location. And lo and behold, there was no location there. So I was like, so where you at? So then I had to call you because now I'm like, all right, he probably in the ditch somewhere. His phone ain't getting good service. He he can't call me because he in the sticks. Like I didn't know what had happened. We're too can we're too on one accord. I don't believe none of this. <laughs> look, look at me, look at me. Hey, look, hey, our souls are like these intertwined, okay. and I can just okay, I'll be for real. And like, <laughs> and like I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna tell you the truth. Just, I, I can just say, feel. I'm gonna tell I can you just. The truth. I'm <laughs> Come forward. Tell the truth. truth. Shame the devil. I just uh, and share your location with me. I did. I'm trying to tell you the truth. It was when you was at your ex pastor house. (laughs) (laughs) Yo. Yo. That's when it was. You was taking too long. You was over there for like five hours. And I just I I was like And my location wasn't on? No, that was the lo- last time your location was on. That's the last time I I checked. Ah, uh, okay. And then the other day, you know how you can go in and I was looking for a a picture. <laughs> <laughs> hey, go ahead. Now go ahead. <laughs> Why you keep laughing? <laughs> Why you keep laughing? <laughs> That's the way you looking at me. Stop looking at me. <laughs> I was looking for a picture and I noticed that you didn't have your location on. That is the truth. You know how you do this and you hit the info. Mm-hmm. It didn't come up like it usually comes. You're making me cry. It usually comes up with a map and there was no map there. Okay. That's when I noticed. 
Mm. But the last time that I checked was when you was over there yeah, and you was right. taking some long, and I was like, he way too close to his baby mama house. Let me call. Let me check. Baby. Right there. Did you share That's yours? That's the truth. Did yes, share, I did. Okay. Indefinitely. We back, on, we back on board. I don't listen to me. I don't know what happened because I literally did not know that my location was on. I forgot about Dallas. I don't be on. Like, we didn't go to Dallas. It was Nashville. Nashville. <laughs> I don't even look. Who you know in Dallas? Oh, I'm not doing this with you. <laughs> I'm not doing this with you. <laughs> Oh Lord! Okay, so I don't know what this episode's about. Check your location. <laughs> that's a good question. That's what we did talk. That's what we did talk about. How many y'all share your location? That that's what I want to know. This is only for iPhone users. Sorry, we are excluded users. some people. I think but Samsung could do that. You think so? They got map. Cool. Yeah, maybe I don't know. Mm. But oh, that's good. That's good. So right. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what was what was this about? Thank you for tuning into this week's uh weekly check in. Absolutely. We wanna know from you guys, is texting cheating? Um, I know. I think the biggest that was the intro talk. The question is <laughs> <laughs> Do you share your location with your spouse or your mates? Ooh. Why or why not? Oh, that's good. All right. And if you do share, how much do you check it? That part. <laughs> That's good. All right, we got to go. As always, we love love. Y'all should love love too. Peace. Peace.